Hey everybody, I hope you all have a wonderful time during the holidays, especially Christmas. And it's been quite a while since making a video which was a prediction video of WWE TLC and GTS BLT. I thought about making a result or uh, was it review video. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to do it because I had so many schedule conflicts during the holidays. It's hard for me to find a better time to make some content video on this channel. I'll be honest, GTS BLT was pretty decent. WWE TLC, eh, not so much, especially the main event had so many botch fests. But hey, I did watch Christmas Chaos and I enjoyed every second of it. Well, some of them are pretty disappointing. And the ending was pretty much the same, I would say. So I'm making this as an update video mainly, but also I got some future announcements I wanted to make for this channel. So first thing for my content videos on this channel, as of this moment, I will be back on making videos on daily basis. I will try my best on releasing video contests for you all. Videos will be out almost every single day, which I don't know if I can guarantee that. I was gonna release the next Q&A video yesterday, but I don't think anyone pays attention nor read the post on my community board on my channel. So I decided to postpone it to maybe most likely Sunday if any of you can ask me some questions for my next Q&A. So please leave your comments down below and I will be happy to answer it. And just so you know, there will be some more contents coming up soon on this channel such as top 10, wrestling news, theme songs, predictions, slash results or reviews, whatever, and etc. Now speaking of predictions and reviews, from now on, I won't be doing any more predictions on every WWE pay-per-view shows, except for the big four like SummerSlam, Survivor Series, Royal Rumble, and WrestleMania. And the same goes for GTS pay-per-view shows, except for Sucker Slam, Solid Steel Series, Regal Rumble, and Gremamia. But although, I could be predicting, well, food in the fridge, unless if it's something good. But from now on, I don't think I'll be doing every prediction videos on GTS and WWE. Schedule conflict is the problem for me nowadays. I will predict every AEW pay-per-view shows, which only have like at least four pay-per-view shows per year, along with some other wrestling shows like New Japan, especially Wrestle Kingdoms happening on the January 4th and 5th next year at the Tokyo Dome. So stay tuned for that. Just a reminder, in case you didn't pay attention, I will be back on making videos on my full-time basis, and videos will be out almost every single day, unless if I had to postpone it due to my conflict schedule outside of YouTube. So yeah, that's how it's going to be like next year. Second thing, now speaking of next year, I thought it would be a great time to announce that I would make some gaming videos on my new channel. Unfortunately, something's gonna happen on the first day of January 2020, and it's that COPPA is coming and could possibly affect those gaming YouTubers. And I don't know if I can take this as a risk on my new channel, but please go check out my new YouTube channel. And that's going to be my backup, just in case if this channel dies. Third thing. There's nothing to say in particular. All I wanted to say is thank you for supporting this channel and thank you for clicking this important video, I would say. And I'm grateful that I'm gonna start making videos once again and releasing content for you all. As a matter of fact, we are getting close to 8,000 subscribers. So for those of you who are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe this channel and click the notification button so you don't want to miss one of my recent videos. 2020 is coming in less than a week, so I'm looking forward to see what the future holds. Now I want to say thank you again to all my fans, subscribers, and people who are watching around the world. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of 2019. Stay safe, peace, and cheers.